This Red Bull cost me 1 euro and 39 cents and it contains a solid 80 milligrams of caffeine. And this energy drink here cost me around 20 cents and it has 2.5 times the amount of caffeine. When Red Bull gives you wings, then this thing gives you a space rocket. So you are asking, how did I end up with the best energy drink in EU? As the label clearly says. Well, here's what happened. In the month of January, I worked 42 hours of overtime at my full-time job. And if it wasn't for a vast amount of energy drinks I consumed, during that time, I'm not sure I would have survived it. But there is one problem with it. If you go and buy an energy drink from a grocery store every single day, it will get rather expensive. And that's why I have decided to enter to market with my own energy drink. So, how are we gonna do this? There are exactly three criteria. Cri oh, <laughs> Let me try again. There are exactly three criteria that need to be passed in order to have a successful energy drink. First one. It needs to be healthy, because I'm gonna be drinking it every single day. Second, it needs to be cheap, because I'm gonna be drinking it every single day. And the third one, it needs to taste good, because I'm gonna... yeah, you know. But there is still one problem. I have no idea how to make an energy drink. Energy drink. Energy... Yeah, I definitely need help. So I went to my best friend to ask for advice. No, not him. I mean him, or her, I don't... I don't think it has a gender. And not surprisingly, ChatGPT gave me some really good advice, unlike my other friend. What the hell? You didn't even ask me anything. Well, that was easy. I guess let's go shopping. Also, I just noticed, please do not look at my mousepad. <laughs> I know it's dirty, but come on, if your mousepad is clean, can you really call yourself a gamer? Okay, I will clean it for the next time, okay? Because I spent all my money on all these energy drinks, I can't really afford to buy any ingredients. That's when I realized I can return all these empty bottles for 10 cents a piece, and that way I can hopefully buy all the ingredients I need. <laughs> Let's go. Luckily, there wasn't many ingredients, and they're rather cheap, so the rest of the money I spent on this. It's for an upcoming video. Wow. You might want to subscribe. Anyways, now it's time to get to the good part. We're gonna need to boil some water. So there's really two reasons why I'm making this video. The first reason is that I really, really, really do love energy drinks. I drink them all the time. I'm gonna back away a little bit because I'm afraid you can, cannot hear me. And the second reason is that this part is muted because I can't spill this information yet. You get it? Spill. <laughs> Um, because I'm really passionate about this thing, I'm gonna tell you at the end of the video when the moment is right. I hope you enjoyed watching me talk very enthusiastically about literally nothing. So yeah, that's why I'm making this video, just so you know. Okay, I'm gonna take over from here, otherwise it's just gonna be a really long and boring segment, so I'm gonna walk you through it real quick and we can move forward with taste tasting. Here I'm showing you how messy my kitchen is, because I realized you might be confused as to why I'm filming this in my living room. Then I went for a quick walk, because I recorded this when I just previously had a 16 hour workday, so I needed to freshen up. After that I went to a small road trip with my girlfriend, and we had the most amazing date night. And oh yeah, if you wanna create this energy drink, then I just follow this recipe here on the screen, and and then I let it stay overnight in the fridge to cool it down. Here it is, looks pretty good to me. And now it is gonna be in a bottle after the transition. Okay, this, this is the worst transition I've ever done. So this bottle of best energy drink in EU cost me around 20 cents per bottle. So we did hit our goal number one. It is super cheap. We do have some sugar in here, but you can always use honey or whatever else you want. Personally, I feel it's safe to say that we did hit our goal number two as well, which is that it's pretty healthy. And now comes the final test, because if it doesn't taste good, I will not be drinking it every day. Okay. Hmm. I am... Positively surprised, I must say. Wow. <laughs> this really took me by surprise. You can tell that it's homemade and it only has like three ingredients, but it's not bad. But of course, you cannot only trust my opinion. Let's see what other people think. Now it's time to tell you the real reason I'm making this video. For the last couple of years, I've been feeling like there's very little innovation in the energy drink industry. For example, how come I still experience a caffeine crash every time I drink a Red Bull or a Monster? I'm super passionate about energy drinks, but I really hate how they make me feel after the caffeine has run through my system.
system. I found some companies with a solution that's much more clean and never gives me any caffeine crashes or any weird anxiety and my hope is that one day my YouTube channel is big enough that I could either partner with one of these companies or completely create my own energy drink to bring everyone or at least my viewers a more healthy and sustainable way of consuming energy drinks. Now recently we reached 1k subscribers <laughs> which is one step closer to the stream so thank you very much for your support. I know we are far from this stream to come true but I have all the time in the world so I'm not worried about that. I just wanted to put this message out there with this video.